has anybody threatened you? You said that's okay. Has that happened? I, I, I don't know if I said what I meant. We're there on the set to shoot the movie. And if the director is unable to get the performance out of the actor, that is when anything goes. Um, and on the other hand, directors who scream just for the sake of screaming because they want to be powerful or something, that's, that's not what I'm talking about either at all. Um, but uh, Tommy Lee Jones, I would go back and work for him as a director in a second and he was not pleasant to work for. Oh, why would you go He's back and, and why brilliant. was he not pleasant? I, I, um, sorry, Mr. Jones. If he gets the best out of you, then it's... That's, if it's to get the best out of you, anything goes. I yeah. think with Mr. Jones, because it's not only the actors that he yells at, it's everyone on the set. Chris Mangus, everybody. Um, I think it's because it the is free, so the desperately, deeply of, uh, important to Mr. Jones, who is very well known as an actor, to succeed as a director. And I think that I hope someday he gets a chance to direct more, and I hope that he can realize that everybody is dying happily to do whatever he would ask of us. Um, when we shot Three Burials, I had made a choice that I leaned back against the car when I told Pete that I knew who killed his friend. And we had blocked it that way. I went and finished getting ready, it came back, and Pete comes wandering out of the cabin. I come out of the car. I lean back against the car. Suddenly, Mr. Jones was there. <laughs> Stand up straight! I stood up straight. I wasn't happy about it, but I stood up straight. We played the scene. Some long time later, I saw the film for the first time. We were shooting on his ranch in West Texas that he knew every blade of grass, bird, by their song. And when the character stands there giving Pete this messenger angel news, the Texas sun is setting right behind my head, which it would not have been if I was leaning back. So... Thank you.